welcome back to my channel, Brian the Divine Healer here. I finally got in. So I figured I'd come up here and give you guys a couple messages because it's been a few days without power, water. It's been a little bit of a struggle, but I have some amazing neighbors that I'm pretty blessed to have around. And we do the community thing. So give a quick shout out to them. And then Divine Squad, thanks for coming back. You shoot your likes, your shares, your subscribes, and your comments, right? News. Welcome back. Thank you again. Appreciate it. Come on the channel. Check it out. Share it to all your friends. Tell the subway guy. Tell you, you know, the guy shoveling your street, breaking up the ice on your front porch. You know what I'm saying? The people in Texas, I uh, give a shout out. Hope y'all warm and safe. You know, all that you need. God, God help us. Amen. So I already did a mad shuffling. Okay, we just left off with Aquarius. So Aquarius, thank you very much. So, okay, this is going to be the final readings for this fabulous february i'm gonna start working hard on some more right okay just want to make sure that i get a stable internet so i apologize if the videos are a little short -aid, right so you know the drill okay two cards up there I tell you the story blah 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 at the end i tell you two more cards to bounce out your energy right here we go so pisces this is going to be your energy um like i said the internet's a little so i have to keep it you know a little bit on the lesser side of for time because it will be easily uh digested from my phone to the youtube right just suck right out of my phone <laughs> and it won't take as long okay i'm just saying that because you know i don't know my internet's been in and out so let's just keep it going okay so fortunate now to get power and i got my fireplace going we got a little bit of heat so we're working out here There's still no water but we'll get by so here we go just for two minutes into the reading Pisces, welcome. Come on in, sit down, have a relaxed break. Here's your energy now. Temperance. You must display balance, or you are displaying balance, peace and harmony, mixing things together, sorting your passions through your emotions. That's that. Sorting your emotions, your passions, the red side, the blue side, that's the passion, fire side, right? Okay, so that wants to be too many. Right, so you're displaying balance, patience, you know, you are kind of in hermit mode, but not really in hermit mode, right? Not so much hermit, you're just really activating your third eye, you're getting grounded, you may be ascending a little bit, right? So, and uh, here's a different story. So now you have to find patient and balance about this message that comes to you about love, or that you want to put out this message of love. Either way, you have to balance your passions. That means your drive, your mojo, your fire to your emotions, right? Look at it go. The blue side is your emotions. The red side is your passion fire, right? So this is what you have to display over this message of love. This small island, text message, email, phone call, pigeon carrier, Federal Express, however they work it, right? We're gonna get into the story and figure out what, 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 who, why, and when, and how. Here we go. Zit. Okay. So now we got some kind of attainment of some wands. So there's some passion going on here, right? There's some things that you're gonna leave behind. Some things that are bugging you. Some things that have been blocking you. Right? You, you, you're gonna be oppressed, feeling oppressed, but you can overcome it. Okay. Persevere. Attain this. Ability to let things go, put things in the past, right? Kind of stopped you, blocked you, right? It's a blockage card, okay? Well, you're not going to let anything stop you or block you because this is a new start in love. Ace of, Ace of Cups, right there. Boom. Overabundance, joy, love, overflowing, right? Ace of Cups. That's fantastic, Pisces. So, you are determined. This is what you're balancing of letting some shit go, putting things behind you to... Go ahead and take this new start in love. That's figgy fantastic. And the seven of wands comes out. So there's a lot of passion and fire, right? So there could be um, some strife, right? There might be a discussion that needs to be had, right? About this new cup of love. Maybe you're kind of wondering if you should go ahead and put things in the past to go ahead and plant roots with this person. Okay. Or this new cup of love. One, two, okay, we'll do three. There's three, okay? So bottom first, because that's three. Let me first. 
So now here comes the Three of Wands. You're going to explore the idea passionately, deciding to leave things behind you and explore your horizons. Congratulations, you decided to move forward, right? And explore this idea a second time. Right. Now death and transformation comes. Not death as in literal, but transformation as in like different perspective. You change your energy, your attitude changes. Something about you is changing, it's transforming, right? Because you decided to go ahead and explore this opportunity, this new cup of love. But you see burdens, you are, you are carrying burdens, or that the death card here comes out. So you will be now, it will be death to the burdens. Okay, so you won't have it. They'll be gone once you kind of accept this idea that you can be confident in knowing that the discussion you have about what you're going to leave behind to, you know, ground yourself with this person who offered you a new cup of love and you want to explore this. So you're willing to now drop these other two ones out of the three of ones and go with your horizons that now transforms you to leave any burdens that you've been carrying behind you. Good job. Pisces. And then now you'll work together. Great as teamwork. Because once you drop those burdens, you feel confident enough in the person that who are you are with, and you will work together to build the stability that you're confident in that you two can, you know, achieve together in this new new cup of love, right? Fantastic. Well, that leads to the yellow brick road, my friends, my Pisces, right? Ace of Pentacles, brand new start in the total abundance. Great job, great monies, great house, great car. Fucking dope ass TV, fridge, all this shit. Earthly realm, stability, Ace of Pentacles, brand new start. Maybe get a really good job with you two because you two work together. That you have a, um, a business that you create and it's really successful. Look at the magician just comes right up upside down. We'll take that. So now the magician comes out. And so now it means once you're walking down this yellow brick road of success together, Three of Pentacles, teamwork. The magician comes out. So now you're able to manifest things in your life together for each other. That's kind of what I'm getting, right? So that's the temperance, right? That's the energy of that new cup of love. So it's exciting. It's new. It's, it's manifesting a lot of positive energy, right? About stability of your foundation. So that's what now you guys are manifesting. You are manifesting on stability stabilizing four of pentacles stabilizing your finances your career maybe you're joining forces because with with the um uh the three of pentacles that's teamwork you know a little disorder but that's something different not in this one uh you work together and now you're balancing this stability to you know maybe buy a house together or, you know something of that nature which has to do with you know the pentacles so you two are working on it together manifesting this great idea and here comes the king of swords so boom this is the energy that i get in you guys' mind of you're you both take action you're both serious you're both on it because it is under the three of pentacles so clarifying the king of swords saying that you guys will take action in your mind to be vigilant of the relationship and consciously work on this stability that you two both can manifest amen have a sip of coffee. Oh, by the way, hit the like button and the subscribe. And tell your friends, tell your neighbors, tell the subway guy, tell the grocery store bagger, tell the checkout person, uh, you know, tell everybody. The dog walker, the mechanic, the boat guy, everybody, you know. It's a great channel. We're growing. We're doing good. Okay. So here we go, Pisces. This is the last card of your story. We're going to finalize it after that with two cards for the verdict, the outcome of Finishing off your energy and closing this out. So here comes the two of swords. Intimacy, romance. Uh, this could be the choice under the moon, but I've already think that you've decided to explore this idea to change and manifest and drop its burdens, work together to have this perfect emotional new start and stability because you two are manifesting this stability together and you both are taking action in your mind, be vigilant of the relationship, and that makes it the most intimate. That for you is the most intimate. So this is a really passionate 
romantic, overabundant kind of a love. Amen. And so here we go with the verdict. King of Wands. He popped up last reading. This guy's tricky. Okay. So, fiery, action, orientated. You guys are hot, passionate, you're into it. Uh, ooh, sultry, you know, like opposite of the Queen of Wands. Well, I mean, they're the same kind of deal. But this is a very strong energy that it's like kind of sealing a deal. Right. So, with the last card here, comes out the Six of Cups. Nostalgia. Uh, looking back, making you feel good about reflecting in this relationship. Nostalgic, right? So this person makes you very nostalgic because they're hot, they take action, and it's great. So, Pisces, this has been a wonderful little roller coaster. I appreciate that. Thank you for your time, your energy, your likes, your shares, your subscribes. I hope anybody in my area or around Texas in general is safe and good to go. There's no issues and everybody's safe and protected, okay? So everybody else in the world, I thank you for coming back. Hit the like button, share, subscribe, tell the whole world. Amen. Peace and pray. See you on another day.